as a person, I truly don't believe in second generation entrepreneurship. Okay, what I've seen out of some friends who had to live that, it's personal thing. On the top of that, I engage with conversation with some of my children, which one is there in the back, and they have their own passion. And as a father, I want to be able to, to support their passion. And you know, imagine two seconds, to be able to be there as a guide, as a supporter, being a gardener of the, the seed you had planned in life, and having them achieve their dream and not having to carry on the dream of their father, is so precious. And this is the opportunity that I had been giving them through this transaction. I cannot wish more than anything that they will, because I, I love them all. They're all intelligent. They all being developing passion through their life. This is one goal I gave myself as a father to make sure that they will develop a passion before the age of 10. And trust me, they do. So I'm in full confidence that they will, at a certain moment, pick up on something, and I'll be there to support. Not only financially, but in terms of presence, in terms of guidance, in terms of transfer of knowledge. This is not what it is about in life and in relation to family. I want to live that instead of just throwing them in the jungle, because this is a jungle. It needs a lot, and it's a lot of pressure, and I don't want to give them that I, as a starting point. And none of them yet had raised except the little seven years old that want to be a clown. And, wanna, and she already had made her decision. It will not be Cirque du Soleil. It will be Cirque de Lune. And by then, it might be the competition of Cirque du Soleil. I don't know. Merci. We might buy the back that Cirque du Soleil. <laughs> Merci. What is it that uh, the new partners, new owners could do specifically that you couldn't do on your own? Are you kidding me? <laughs> She's like, this is, this, this, the network they have is amazing. Two things. They have an amazing network. They have money. They have a full team of people that could reinforce Sir Grote. Uh, they seem to show quite good passion. And they're, they're full of energy. I was starting to spread out. And I would not be, it would not be right for Sir. It would not have been right for myself to not have to look at what I'm doing today. You know, in life sometimes you could be stubborn or you could look at yourself and the reality of things. And that's what I did. Time will tell me if I'm right or wrong for myself or the sick. But in all consciousness and with a rigorous reflection, personal reflection or corporate reflection, I believe today I'm making the best decision for Sikh du Soleil and his future and the best decision for myself and my family. Thank you, sir. Now, I have to...